Well, after a record breaking 215 days at sea, sailors with the USS Stout are home with their families tonight. Penny, your side's Kara Dixon was at Naval Station Norfolk when the ship finally came in. It's been a long deployment for those on board the USS Stout. They left Naval Station Norfolk back in January. As well as family and friends who anxiously counted down the days they'd see them again, like the Aducis, Mary Kate, Damien, Philomena, and Allery. Just really excited. I'm ready. Ready to take him home. Yeah, you too. It's not Mary Kate's husband Tim's first deployment, but deployments are always a challenge. Uh, 2020 has been a different challenge. Um, but I'm really just excited now. That's all that matters right now. While family waited outside the gates, the stout arrived shrouded almost in mystery, coming back to a world vastly different than the one they left behind nine months ago. To be honest with you, it's hard to believe, but it went by pretty quick. The stout broke a record of being at sea for 215 consecutive days and worked with two strike groups providing security in international waters. Couldn't be more proud of them. They did great. Uh, they really showed that they're resilient, self-sufficient. Um, I don't. I don't really have the words to say how proud I am of them. While things may not be back to normal, those on board prepared for a life during COVID before coming home. Uh, for the past two weeks, we've just been getting the muscle memory down with the mask. We've been doing a lot of training for the crew. Uh, fortunately, the Ike strike group, the rest of the Ike strike group, came in a little bit before us, so we got some really good lessons learned from them. Uh, good do's, don'ts, and then just like I said, working on the muscle memory for everything. Making sure safety is a priority while also making sure they get much needed family time that they deserve. For more information on their deployment, check out wavy.com. At Naval Station Norfolk, I'm Kara Dixon, 10 on your side.